Okay, let's do this thing! You were wide open, so I just went for it. Matt, you little punk. Look, you guys have got a choice to make here. Either get off this planet and go home, or you're gonna wind up like your friend here. Did you hear that, Bertha? This jolt knocks out Raccoon with a lucky shot, and suddenly he's dishing out threats to the likes of us. Hmm, he's got some nerve. Let's teach you, Shield Punk, why the Ginyu Force are the most elite warriors in the galaxy. Let's go! Yeah! This is what happens to morons who underestimate the Ginyu Force. What? How dare you!
So, this is the guy, huh? His power level's only around 5,000. That's him, Captain. And I thought the same thing. Don't be fooled. He must be capable of boosting his strength in the midst of combat. From what I can tell, I'd say his true power level is somewhere around 60,000. 60,000? But this guy's just a bloody Saiyan! It's not unheard of. He could have a natural talent, or perhaps his abilities have been amplified by a mutation like us. Either way, this battle's sure to be interesting. To think I'd find an opponent that I can finally demonstrate my full power on. So, are we gonna dance or fight? <laughs> Have fun, Kakarot! Petita! This is gonna be good! for help, Chase. I'm perfectly capable of fighting my own battles. But in again, and it'll be you I pulverize. Understood? All right, let's go. Yeah. Share your energy with me. For a spirit bomb. Done. <laughs> Your strength is unbelievable. Yeah, I think I'll take it. What do you mean by that? Change now! Listen! That's not me! It's Ginyu! Using my body! Vegeta, why? They couldn't even defend themselves! Shut up! You're too soft-hearted, Kakarot! It's kill or be killed! Now it's time to finish the job! Now die! Fool! Change now! Please let this work! What? Oh no! B bastard! How dare you! You ruined everything! I'm back to being me again! What what the hell is going on? What does Kakarot think he's doing? I better swap with a fresh body and quick! Yours will do, Vegeta! Oh! Or nothing! <laughs> What in the world? Whew, that was a close one. Now get ready. Hang 
on just a little bit longer. I'm on my way, guys! I... I'm begging you, please! Beat him! For me! For the pride of our race! You must defeat him! Please, he must die by a Saiyan's hand! For you to beg me for my help. I can only imagine how hard that must have been for you to do. I may have hated you when you were alive, but I always respected your pride. And now, it's time for me to share that pride. Pride in myself. I am a Saiyan that was raised on planet Earth. And in the name of every single Saiyan that you've made suffer, for them, and all the people of Planet Namek too, I will defeat you! And I would just love to see you try. Both of you, we need to get out of here and quick. We'll only be in the way. Go on! Come on, hurry! Please don't die! Take this! Awesome. I don't know if I've ever felt this excited about the prospect of a battle in my entire life. Now I only need to decide how I'll kill you. I think I'll toy with you a bit. Again, if I want to win this fight, my only choice is to gather enough energy for a spirit bomb. God, share your energy with me for a spirit bomb. against placing too much stock in your escape. Though if you like, I can bring you closer to home! <laughs> Trillin! No, Frieza! Don't do it! Goku! Hmm. <laughs> 
I think the brat should go next. You! You! Ruthless! Heartless! Bastard! Go! Take Piccolo with you and get out of here now! Find Bulma, find the spaceship, and go! But... Do as I tell you right now, before I lose what little sense of reason I have left! His power is expanding even more than his muscles. This really must be 100% of his full power. Go, go, go. Goku, are you listening to me down there? Quit, Quit standing around and finish him! This is our one chance! It also may be the only chance I'll ever have to fight him. If he really is the strongest being in the whole universe, I need to see if I can beat him myself. What, what did you just say? Goku, listen to yourself! You're out of your mind! There's no point to this! Krillin can't be brought back to life with the Dragon Balls a second time! And I refuse to take the death of my best friend sitting down! Krillin was my best friend! And Frieza took him from me! He killed him in an instant! Like he was nothing! 85% now! 90! Frieza, just know the only reason I'm letting you reach full power because I want to beat you at your best, with no regrets for either one of us. I know you want the same thing. You're itching to see what your 100% full power is capable of. Otherwise, you would have blown up the whole planet by now. <laughs> We're settling this right here and now! My apologies for the wait. This is my full power! Then do you want to finish this, or are you just going to keep talking? Yeah! 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 We're settling this right here and now! Yeah! yeah. yeah. We're settling this right here and now! Yeah! yeah. 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 <sighs> We're settling this right here and now! What? Dumb a little cockroach! I blow you into a million pieces! Just like I did that earthling. That earthling? Are you talking about Krillin? Don't you dare! Say his name! We're settling this right here and now! Dragon to leave both Frieza and me behind. Oh, I I'm serious, King Kai. You have to let me finish this battle with Frieza, or I'll never forgive you. All right, fine, you win. But you really better beat it. Don't make me regret this. Get ready to see my real strength.
<laughs> oh, the irony. He who triumphs loses everything, while the vanquished escapes. I hate to gloat, but there's a lesson here on the virtue of mercy. Its only value is to your foe. We'll see about that. I am Lord Frieza, the most powerful being in the universe. Which is why... Which is why... You must die by my hand! You fool! Here goes! Piccolo, what do you say? Want to train with me and Gohan? I've been raring to fight you again. Sure, sounds good to me. Krillin, what about the rest of you guys? Thanks, but I'm gonna head to Master Roshi's and train with him, actually. Oh, well, okay. Up there, in the sky! He was attacked from above! There are too many innocent people here! Let's take this somewhere else! You agree to that, at least? Too many innocent people? Well, that is a problem which can be easily corrected. Stop it! You bastards! It was my understanding you wanted the streets free of onlookers. Evidently, our solution does not please you. That's it! Follow me, and we're gonna settle this! If all you know about me is from before I went to Namek, you're about to be in for a real shock! Whoa! Hmm. 
You guys stay out of this. If I'm the one these guys want, then that's what they're gonna get. A most intriguing discrepancy, this dormant power. It departs rather considerably from the data previously compiled. But it is not remotely discouraging. His strength is within manageable parameters. Android number 19 shall now operate as your executioner. Is that right? Fine. Then get over here and fight me! Take this! His strength is immeasurable. This Super Saiyan transformation put Goku on a level far beyond us all. <laughs> we'll see. If I want any chance of winning battles to come, then I need to train hard enough to find a level beyond Super Saiyan. It started. Piccolo's getting ready to fight. Yeah, but who? Do you think it's Cell? No. Whoever it is, I can't sense their energy, so it's gotta be one of the other androids. Stop, Gohan! We can't help it! We're nowhere near their level right now! All we do is slow Piccolo down! Uh, Dad, that energy! It, it's gotta be Cell! He's on the move! I'm telling you, there's nothing we can do to help Piccolo with the level of strength we're at right now! Come on, Vegeta! What's taking you so long? Check out my perfect form. It's perfect.
The Cell Games have officially begun. Now, if any of you should dare to step forward, I would like to kick things off. I'll go first. Well, well. I was hoping to save the best for last, Goku. But so be it. Come on! There's a lot more where this came from. I give up. I fought as hard as I could, but it's pretty clear there's no way I can beat you. So that's it for me. Truth is, I hate fighting, and I don't want to kill anyone. Believe it or not, I don't even want to kill a bad guy like you. Now, my precious little babies, see those seven spectators up there? Kill them all! Keep your guard up! These things are way stronger than they look! Damn it all! I, I'm sorry, guys. I messed up! I didn't think things would end up like this.
telling you to stop! All right, Cell Juniors, playtime's over. Do as Daddy says and kill them all! Right now! Ended already? <laughs> I'm not letting him off that easy. He deserves to feel the same pain he put all his victims through. <laughs> Am I seeing things or did he just puke up 18? You. 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 Son of a... Huh? In a few moments, I'll blow myself to bits. <laughs> I might die, but then so will all of you. This planet will explode in a burst of flame. If you lay a finger on me, boom! Bye-bye, Earth! No sense in wasting your last few seconds while you got them. <laughs> I've killed us. It's all my fault. I could have finished him, but I didn't. <laughs> I... I know that look. Sorry, I've thought this over, guys. Well, any way you slice it, there's only one way to save Earth. Goodbye, my friends. Uh, goodbye? You're not thinking of... Goku! No! You did good today, Gohan. You made me proud. Dad, what are you... Tell your mom I'm sorry. I'm not gonna make it home this time. His energy, it's gone without a trace.
Take care, okay? Live your lives to the fullest, and I'll see you again when you're dead! Bye-bye! Uh, are we back at the tournament arena? What's wrong with you? Vegeta, tell me it isn't true. You let Bobbity Spell take control of you, didn't you? Because doing something like this would make me fight you. It's true, isn't it? If I hadn't gone to these links, we wouldn't be about to fight. I had one day, one measly day in which to beat you, and I wasn't going to waste it standing around on that ship. That was your reasoning? You killed countless innocents to try and repair your meaningless pride? Meaningless? What do you know of meaningless? I don't give a damn about Majin Buu. All I want is my fight with Kakarot. Here and now, I will emerge as the victor once and for all. There's no reason he ever should have bested me. He and I are both Saiyans. But I was royalty among our people. I was a prince, yet he prevailed. He, he even had the impudence to save my life before. And that is an indignity I cannot bear. Poverty! Move us to some place where there's no one else around! I'll give Vegeta the fight he wants, but not here! <laughs> All right then, guess you can find somewhere else. <laughs> For you to go this far, you must have wanted to settle the score real badly, huh, Vegeta? Can't lie, I get it. This might take longer than I thought. It'll be over soon enough when I kill you! I already told you, the only thing that matters to me is this battle. Everyone else can die for all I care! You're lying. Deep down, I know your soul is still the same, Vegeta. That's what you get! Yeah! 
I am Vegeta, principal yeah. Saiyan! Yes. That's what you get. <laughs> Fine, let's take care of this boo first. You wouldn't give me your best in this fight if you were too distracted. Vegeta! All right, Margin B. Kill this guy first. Right now! Who hear you first, guy? Come on, big guy. Why is somebody as strong as you taking orders from a shrimp like Bobbity? Nobody asked for your opinion. Margin B is my loyal servant, and he obeys my every command. If he knows what's good for him. the golden hair trick, and look what happened to him. Hold on. There's regular old Super Saiyan. Then there's a level beyond Super Saiyan. But further beyond that... That's what you get! Sorry this took so much longer than the others, but I haven't had as much practice with this one. This is what I call Super Saiyan 3. If I don't, who will? <laughs> Hopefully that means he found the Dragon Radar and is leaving West City.
Goku, I'm sorry, but it's about time we took you back to Otherworld. Right. I understand. <laughs> What's the matter, Goten? <laughs> Goten, honey. Do you want to give your dad a hug before he goes? Aw, oh, was that all? You should have said so, son. Bring it in. Goten, you take good care of your mom for me, okay? <laughs> well, that's it, everybody. I'll see you all on the other side. at how easily I'm kicking your face in. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, 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 
Canada! Forward, Ghost Teams! Anyway, I've had just about enough fun for one day. So I'm going to give you ten seconds to say your prayers before I wrap this up. This is bullcrap! Alright, let's hope this plan's crazy enough to work. This drink is truly amazing. You've always been like this, ever since the day I first met you. You were prepared to meet a challenge, even when it was bigger than you were. First, I thought it was your loved ones. That it was your blind instinct to protect them that spurred you on, pushed you beyond your limits. And certainly that was the part of it. But over the years, I realized there was more. Something else in the way you approach a battle. I used to fight for the sheer pleasure of it. Sparing no one, I killed the dominant to feed my insatiable pride. But you never fight to kill, or even to win, only to test your limits and become the strongest you could possibly be. You showed mercy to everyone. As if you knew one day I would possess the tiniest sliver of the soul. And here I am, fighting alongside you. Defy all logic. By some miracle, your compassion has rubbed off on me. And yet I still don't fully understand how you do it. How can you say and fight with such power? And at the same time be so gentle? Perhaps it's my anger that made me blind to the truth for so long. Hang in there, Kekaro. You are number one. A real fight starts now! If I don't, who will? Dragon Bat! Kakarot, you can finish him off on your own. Just charge your energy all the way and vaporize this monster. Uh, what do you think I've been trying to do? I just haven't had a chance to concentrate. I can't focus my power. It's just so hard when he keeps coming at me. I only need a minute. One minute, that's all! Fine, then I'll make my stand against him for the next minute. And while he's occupied, you power up! Hey, Supreme Kai's and Dende! Do you hear me up there? If you can, then say something, damn it! Vegeta! I think it's about time we let the people of Earth shoulder the burden for once. The plan is underway. It's time for you to create a spirit bomb. But even if I collect a little energy from all the people who were brought back, it still won't be enough to take down Boo! It won't just be a little bit. You'll get every ounce of spirit energy they can spare! <laughs> it will be more than a spirit bomb, Vegeta. Since I've got it to go, I kind of feel like a proud dad! 
Okay, guys, it's all set. And you can speak not to just Earth, but the whole universe if you want. That's more like it. Citizens of planet Earth, can you hear me? I like this new side of you, Vegeta. Nice going. Here we go. People of Earth, give me your energy. We need you. Incredible warrior, Boo. It was you against the universe. You nearly won. I hope you can come back once more, but good. I want to fight you again, one on one, without all the loss. I'll be right there waiting for you, only stronger. Later. You mean you can stay now? We can all be together like a real family? You and Gohan and Goten are back and there's no catch? That's right! I can't wait to get to Mount Paozu and have some of your good old home cooking, Chi-Chi. Oh, come on, Chi-Chi, why are you crying? I thought it was good news. Here it goes! Let's go, Lord Beerus, you and me! But if I win, you have to leave this planet untouched, deal? Very well, I accept your terms. But know this, none in this universe can hope to match the power of Beerus the Destroyer. I'm not done yet! <gasps> Did the Super Saiyan God thing work? I don't know. It sure seemed like it did, but I can't sense my dad's energy at all. Believe it or not, that's good news. The energy that radiates from a god cannot be detected by mere mortals. Here I am. Here I am. Goes higher and higher! 
This is what I've been waiting for. What do you say we continue this fight on equal footing? God to God. Sounds good to me. I'm only scratching the surface of this new power. I'm going all out! My power goes higher and higher! Ka -me -ka -me -ka! something back. Figured that out, did you? <laughs> well, I had a feeling. But you don't have to hold yourself back for my sake, Lord Beerus. I'm not gonna get any stronger unless you face me with everything you've got. Are you always this talkative? You just don't get it. Vegeta, sorry, but I've got to run. Ugh, fine. Do whatever you want, as usual. It occurs to me. I suppose I should thank you. Thank me? What in the world for? For years, my every step, my every breath has been motivated by a single desire. Revenge. My new power, strength enough to hold the universe by its throat. It was you who gave it to me. Losing to you, to a pathetic Saiyan. It consumed me. The humiliation was too much to bear. Enough! Get to the point! Ha! <laughs> Impatient as ever. Very well. As a token of my gratitude, I will destroy you first. <laughs> I knew it! You've been holding something back, haven't you? That's well deduced for a simpleton. I've held back just like you. I need to get my act together. Then let's both go all in. No tricks, no reserves. All right, now it's your turn. Let's see this new power of yours. Care to cut to the chase, do we? Very well, then I won't hold anything back either. Now brace yourself! Behold my newfound evolution! I know gold's a bit gauche, but I wanted to ensure you grasp my new position atop the pecking order. And for the sake of your feeble mind, let's keep the name simple as well. We'll call this Golden Freezer. Golden Freezer? 
Farewell, Goku. I can't say it's been a pleasure. I'm not normally one for preemptive goodbyes, but there is a very real possibility that I kill you instantly. And I'd rather be safe than sorry. You've always been smug, Freezer. But I guess you've earned it this time. <laughs> You're in my way. No hard feelings! I'm going all out! Break through the limit! It's my turn! Here goes! Sorry, I swung at you without any warning, Goku. For a second there, I thought you were someone else. Nah, you were just rattled. Don't worry about it. So tell us, who is this guy? Would you believe me if I said he called himself Goku? What? Me? He wears dark clothes instead of your orange ones, so we started calling him Goku Black. I'll never forget the day he showed up. He said he was going to exterminate the human race. He said he was doing it in the name of justice. I struggled against him for a year after that, but by that point there were hardly any survivors left on Earth. Then, he tracked down Mom just before I came here. Wait a sec. My future self also wrote a message specifically for me. She wanted us to fix the machine and return with you. That means she wants me to go there and beat Kakarot myself! Come on, Vegeta, it's not me! It must be someone who just looks like me! Hey, Trunks! Help me gauge how strong this guy is. Fight me for a while so you can compare my strength to his. Sure. Saying two right off the bat, huh? Sounds good to me. I figured this out after you left. I call it Super Saiyan 3. That's incredible. I wouldn't expect anything less from you. In that case, I'll show you my strongest move. All right, attack me with everything you've got. Black. Oh, now I see. No wonder I couldn't find you. Hmm. Goku. 
Goku and the Destroyer Beerus. Wow, you really do look alike, huh? How are you, Goku? You're looking quite well. So, we're about to watch Goku versus Goku. It's shaping up to be a fascinating day. I need to get my act together. 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 whole lot stronger than that, right? <laughs> I'm flattered you rate me so highly, but I'm getting too much out of this to rush. <laughs> Kept you waiting, huh? <laughs> this is the finale. you want. The pain will only make me stronger. Uh, okay. That's a pretty creepy thing to say. must be dissipating. It's going back to normal. Would be your utmost pleasure to please engage in fisticuffs with me, your kindness, sir. All right, let's give it a go. You know, I haven't fought a god since Lord Beerus. You fought a destroyer? <laughs> I'm not done.
Indeed. Wait, is that Black's energy? No, oh, but it was awfully close. <laughs> this could be planted sufficient. Just a plain old Kai? You're pretty strong. Between the antisocial psyche that's clearly lurking within him and the energy that he's projected outward, I'd say our suspicions that Zamasu is black have been circumstantially corroborated. Then maybe I should just dispense with him now while I can. Hmm? Huh? You guys sure about this? You know, he really didn't seem like such a bad guy to me. That's because you're too trusting of people. The energy I felt was similar, but it wasn't exactly the same as Black's. It seems there are more mysteries to solve. If you do anything that Grand Zeno finds insulting, he could easily erase you, me, this entire reality from existence. Don't forget that. One more thing, Whis. If Grand Zeno does lash out, make sure it's not at Supreme Kai. I need him protected at all costs. What's up? I mean, good day and greetings. So what's going on with you? What do you want? I'm not asking much. I just want a friend, you see. You're not like most people. You're fun. I want you to be my friend, Ogie Dogie. We can do that, I guess. But is that the only reason you called? Is that a problem? Of course not, Grand Zeno. Goku would feel privileged to be your friend and provide you unsurpassed joy. You be quiet. I'm sorry, Zeno, but actually now's a bad time. There's something I've got to take care of, but when it's done, we can play, I swear! So once you're done with your busy thing, you'll play with me? Sure! And if you want, I can bring somebody else who'd be even more fun to play with, too. So the next time, you won't have to wait on me. Really? Okay, it's a date! Go on, Goku, rejoice! Only through me will you finally reach the pinnacle of beauty you have sought for so very long. You know, I don't know what you're rambling on about. Father! Huh. Hey. Hey. I'm counting on you! 
on you. Your mind is too small. Your kind is incapable of understanding the grandeur of my success and the glory of my cause. It's like staring into the sun. You cannot see. The vast beauty of my being overwhelms you, for I am a breed apart and divine. That's enough. Samasu! I thought you were decent, but you're scheming with black! Scheming? Such a negative word. We are more like calm than a righteous crusade. No hard feelings! No hard feelings! I won't lose! My wait is almost over. Soon the world I've been dreaming of for so long will be made manifest. A truly just and perfect utopian existence. Mortals are unnecessary. And more than that, unwelcome. First your bubble, but there's no way I'm letting you two get what you want. That Goku. This time I'll fight. Final flash! <laughs> May my strength be a shield for all of us mortals. May my strength be a shield for all of us mortals. How disappointing you ungrateful and barbaric creatures are! The gods gave you minds capable of true wisdom, yet you wasted on self-interest and war! How can you talk about the values of mortals after everything you've done to my world? Final Flash! You think you got him? What? It can't be! I've taken godhood to a new level. Divinity made perfect. With a body that befits a Kai. One that is invincible. I can already tell I'm going to be sleeping soundly tonight. A Saiyan? Who's there?
It seems we've returned to a future where there is no black. My world didn't change. I knew it. Beerus couldn't fix this. Not even the act of a god made a difference. We know the truth! All the terrible things you've done! We know you used the Super Dragon Balls to get your power! You think I'm a copy? Oh, you're wrong. This is Goku's actual body, down to the last battle scar. The perfect war machine. I took the Time Ring and found the Super Dragon Balls. Then, with my first wish to the dragon, I switched bodies with you, Goku. Okay, so if you're telling us you're Zamasu, then who's this guy who actually looks like him? From your world's perspective, I'm the Zamasu from this world. And I work for justice with the Zamasu from the past. You haven't worked it out yet, Goku? I'm none other than the Kai once called Zamasu. The god defeated by a mere mortal. You. But how can that be? I saw Beerus destroy you! He said you'd be gone! Old Beerus clearly doesn't understand the full beauty of this time ring. Wearing it protects me. Not even what a god did in the past can affect me. Thanks to the time ring, I could empower my new ally without waiting at all. We collected the Super Dragon Balls in the future and wished again. You were willing to kill your Supreme Kai just to get that ring? Yes. Then we had to make sure no one would undo our accomplishments later. So we found the Super Dragon Balls once more and shattered them. After that, we had to keep the other gods from interfering here. I used your strength to kill every other Kai in this multiverse. That means in this timeline there are no more gods who can stop us. We have all the power. The, the two, two of us, us alone. alone! This destruction was unfortunate, but necessary to achieve our virtuous goal. The Zero Mortal Plan. Mortals are a foolish and ugly mistake that stain the majesty of the cosmos. By eliminating all mortals, creatures, we can reclaim this perfect creation. We've already cleansed a great number of planets of their repulsive mortal blight. Your filthy kind is worst of all. How many times have conflicts nearly destroyed this planet and threatened to spread across the universe? Because you are the ugliest, we are sentencing you to the heaviest punishment. A despair and terror that befits your wicked crimes. And none of you will escape it. This is it, Saiyans. For the sake of our most glorious project, you will die today. Hard 
feelings! Break through the limit! I thought for sure you would have asked by now, Goku. Aren't you concerned about your family? Here we go! No hard feelings! My family? Break through the limit! Ka me! Ka me! Ka! Like where does one begin such a gripping tale? After I collected the Super Dragon Balls and switched bodies with you, I went to Earth to check, to make sure we had really switched. And there I found it. You were shocked to find yourself in my body, and your family was terrified. Ka me Ka me Ka Damn you! What about Chi-Chi? And Goten! Oh, sure. Guess that much, Goku. You monster! You pay for that! You took my body! You took my life! And then you even killed Chi Chi and Goten! You're gonna regret telling me that, Zamasu! Now I'm mad! Now I'm really, really mad! And now it's time to pay! But thank you, Goku. Your anger feels simply incredible. Face my blade. Ka me ka me ka! There will be no more retreating. Now you're trapped here. So this world will be the last you ever see. God, you're surprisingly confused. This isn't going to be our final resting place. It's going to be yours. We were even going to bring you a casket, but we couldn't find one small enough. Our master Goasu and the other Kais were foolish enough to believe mortals could be entrusted with intellect. So, Kakarot, where are you keeping that jar? Oh, crap! It was still in the time machine when they blew it up! How could you be that stupid? Fine. What's done is done. I'd rather win with our fist than some magic trick anyway. <laughs> I was just thinking the same thing. Better keep your focus on me! Mortals do not tell gods what to do! No hard feelings! This should be planted sufficient. No hard feelings! This was just the start. By channeling my divine rage into power, 
I have forged a new instrument with which to destroy you. This sign will carve a reminder into your mortal flesh of the strength of my divine wrath! <laughs> Just as we foresaw, fighting this formidable Saiyan blight has carried us both to new heights. This proves our transformative power. Our destiny is to cast judgment upon all creation. Hold it! <laughs> What's the matter, mortals? Relax! Don't be afraid. I thought you Saiyans love fighting the strongest. Father! Goku! Trunks, you okay? He's weak. Trunks must have done something. Brace yourself against those mortals. We were barely separated. What went wrong? It seems many of our assumptions about mortals were badly mistaken. We are much more than just insignificant worlds. If we're not careful, our dream of utopia is going to be ruined before it's even begun. Very well. No more games will happen, you pathetic, lowly mortals. Heal before our radiance. This game is over. You shall kneel before our radiance. Justice together! Thus begins a new world. Show your reverence and bow down before our splendor. Me! Ha! Me! Ha! Worship. Give praise unto me. Me, the beautiful, the sublime. Me, the invincible, the almighty and divine. All hail, sons. Trumps, keep Boma safe! Right! Goku, Vegeta, are you all right? <laughs> no, no. Yeah, we're a little banged up. But I think we're okay, at least for now. After fusing, he now possesses indestructibility and Saiyan strength. How can you surpass that? Who knows? But no matter what, I will make him pay for everything he's done. With you all the way, Vegeta. I don't care about the odds. We won't stop until he's defeated. Lightning of absolute strength! It's over. It's there. No hard feelings! So we. Going all out. The great honor to fall at the hands of a god, is it not? Yeah. Break through the limit. Yeah. Me. Me. Ah. Dead. Dead. Thanks for joining me on this epic gaming journey. Remember to smash that like button, subscribe for more awesome content, and I'll catch you all in the next adventure.